Good day everyone, welcome to Sir Fox Learning Channel For today's video, alamin po natin paano nga ba malalaman na pwede pala magkaroon ng attraction itong car na sinasakyan ko plus yung car na nasa katabi ko So paano nga ba natin makukuha, malalaman yung kanyang attraction, anong tawag sa attraction na meron nun So kung gusto mong malaman, panoorin mo ang video ito at kung bago ka sa channel na ito, huwag mong kalimutang mag-subscribe at hit ang notification bell at para updated ka sa mga susunod ko pong video lessons. Happy learning! Okay, our lesson for this video is about universal law of gravitation. Our learning target here is to calculate the force. Oh, calculate. Calculate the force of gravitational attraction by using universal law of gravitation. Gravity. A universal law of gravitation states that the gravitational force is proportional to the mass of the two objects, objects and inversely to the square of the distance between them. Mathematically expressed as force, force of attraction, is equal to universal gravitational constant G times the mass of the first object, yung M1, mass of the second object, yung M2, and the square of the distance, the distance between the two objects here. Our gravitational constant is equal to 6.67 times 10 raised to the power of negative 11 newton that meter squared per kilogram squared okay and also this can also express as weight is equal to g or gravitational times the mass, the, the relationship between two masses of an object times E, which is 5.98 times 10 to the power 24 kilograms over the distance of these two objects. Now, for example, you are asked to solve what is the force of gravity between two students of mass 75 kilograms times 60 kilograms separated by 12 meters. So, madali lang. You will just apply our formula. G M M1 M sub 1 times M sub 2 over D 2. D squared rather. Okay? So, let me show you it on the board. Right. Our problem is what is the force of gravity between two students of mass with kilo with 75 kilograms and 60 kilograms. So of course, in solving a problem, it is important for us to determine the given. Our the mass or our M1 or the mass of the first body is 75 kilograms. M2 or the mass of the second body is 60 kilograms. And the distance between them based on the problem is 12 meters. And you are asked, force of gravity. What is the force of gravity between the two bodies? So, later uh, a while ago, we presented the gravitational constant. 6.67 times 10 to the power of negative 11 
Ang unit measure niya is newton that meter squared per kilogram squared. So, mathematically, force of gravity is G or gravitational constant times mass sub one, m sub two over m sub m sub one over m sub two divided by the square of the distance. By substitution, our G is six point sixty seven times ten negative eleven newton that meter squared per kilogram squared times our M1 is 75 kilograms unit measures must indicate it times our M2 60 kilograms over the square of 12 meter squared. So that is 6.67 times 10. Negative 11 Newton that meter squared per kilogram squared times 75 times 60 75 times 60 kilograms four thousand five hundred kilograms squared 12 squared by 144 meter squared you will see here pwede na tayo mag cancel ng mga unit measure pwede na natin cancel ito cancel yan, cancel yan cancel yan, matitira na lang dito okay so equals to Six point sixty seven times ten negative eleven newton times divide mo to four thousand five hundred divided by one hundred forty four thirty one point twenty five. So, multiply mo na lang yan 31.25 times 6.67 raised to negative 11 equals 2.69 Okay? So, pag nag-calculate ka po nito, 6.67 exponent negative 11 times 31.25 Ito yung kakalabasan. Okay, is there any question? At this point, it's your turn. Calculate the force of gravity on 
a 1.5 by 10 raised to the power of 5 kilogram space station at a distance of 3.5 by 10 raised to the 5 meters from Earth's surface. Calculate the force of attraction. And solve the following. What is the force of gravity between two students of, of masses 80 kilograms and 175 pounds separated by 18 meters? Then, yeah. So much for that. Thank you for watching this video. At kung bago ka sa channel na ito, please subscribe and connect to my channel. Thank you and bye.